Okay, and we're back with Pretty Fear and Fearless. Uh, so we're just gonna start off with some like fucking color there. Uh, it's like a brownish looking color. Uh, yeah, just rub that shit on. Make sure it gets in that eye crease. Um, if it's not in the eye crease, you're probably gonna die. So just try and get it in there. Yeah, just go ahead and rub that shit in real nice and good. Just do it for about like 30 minutes or so. And you should be good. Um, yeah, just keep doing that. <laughs> trying to figure out, uh, make sure it's in that eye crease. Because if it's not, I swear you'll die. Okay, now you just can use the unconditional love brown color. Um, it, if you're a little darker, it might not show. But if it is, it, I mean, it's all good. Don't worry, it'll show up. Okay, now just go ahead and rub that shit in. Yeah. Yeah, um, this will take about an hour. Just rub it in as well as you can. If you can't rub it in that well, just like have your dog lick its finger or something and then just have the dog rub it in. Um, that should be good. So yeah, um, if your eye starts to hurt, just like throw some water on it. That should be fine. Yeah, just uh, continue doing that. All right, now we're gonna switch and we're just gonna start going around the outer perimeter of your eye lobe. Um, this is the hard part, because you're going to have to start shading. Okay, now you're going to use Camouflage Palette. Um, you can buy this from your local, uh, Tipsy Fox or any local, um, Handy Mart. Um, but yeah, um, you're just going to use that on your eye. Not really sure what it does, but, um, it looks good. It's about $3.99. I'm not sure if you can get it at Target, but um, if you ha happen to go to Target, you can look. I work at Target, by the way. Uh, okay, so just rub that in. It'll start shading. It'll start looking like a, like a, um, um, okay, yeah, never mind. Uh, you're gonna switch to Clarity, I think it is. Um, kind of like the song, if you've ever heard that song. Um, so you're going to start using that. Um, I'm not sure where you can buy this. I kind of just found it. It was on the street. and Like in the gutter, you know, when it rains. And it washes up through the houses. Yeah, you just need to use that. Um, and then you're going to, like, find some brush. I'm not sure. I think you can find it at, like, uh, an artist's place. I think they sell them at Michael's, actually. Okay, now you're going to use this red-ass color. I'm not really sure. It's fierce, actually. So, you know what that means. About to be a fucking fierce-ass bitch. Okay, so, and then you're just going to start, like, rubbing that through your eye, and, um, that should blend it pretty well, and then you get this nice red tint. It'll be almost like a, yeah, you know what I mean, like, all you girls want it. Um, so yeah, just rub that in. Um, yeah, so just keep doing that for the next, like, three hours, and you should be fine. Um, make sure you squint your eye just like that too, by the way. And those downward motions are very important, by the way. Oh, the pats, okay. And now you're going to use, not really sure what that says, but, um, just go ahead and find a random ass color and throw it on there. It could be yellow, blue, magenta, <clears throat> doesn't really matter. Um, now you're going to start going around even further around your eye and just rub that shit in nice and well. You don't have to use a brush though, like I said. Just ask your dog um, if you can borrow his paw or something. Okay, yeah, and now you want to get a little like closer to the inside of your eye, closer to your nose. Okay, and now you're going to use the morph by um, something I forgot what it said, but um, that's just going to go underneath your um, eyebrow. And if your eyebrows are on fleek, then you're gonna look like a dope-ass bitch, you know what I mean? Okay, now you're gonna just use one eyelash. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, um... Just pat that shit on. Um, yeah, okay, so you're just gonna start slamming your face with this ball 
Um, you can ask, like, the local clown to borrow his nose and just fucking throw that shit on there. Um, yeah, go over your lips for sure. Uh, go in circle, like, just like the motions like I'm doing, just like that, you know? Just like that. Make sure you get in between the nose and all that. Um, if you don't get in the nose, you're gonna fuck around and have some like weird ass spots, and you don't want that. By the way, um, so you're just gonna um, continue using the fearless and thing, you know? Yeah, you guys know what I'm talking about. Oh, that's the mirror. I was kidding. Now you're going to continue using this concealer, um, I knew that term, of course, I've been doing this for years. Um, <clears throat> now continue to go around the nose because if you don't go around the nose and the eyes, like I'm telling you, it will come out like shit. Here's the experience choice. Um, okay, so you're just going to continue um, doing this, just give it about maybe three and a half hours, you should be fine. Um, oh yeah, now you got to use that thing. Um, Go underneath the eye and just slightly dab, just like, almost like if you're painting like on a painter, I mean like on a piece of paper, um, that should be fine too. Yeah, just like that. Make sure you get around the nose like I said. Um, um, uh, I'm trying to figure out what I'm doing next, uh, okay, yeah, there you go. at the top of the head NYX you already know okay now I'm just gonna get a paintbrush uh, probably a large size and just start rubbing it in it doesn't have to be like the makeup things you could just go to like um, Michael's buy like the largest paintbrush you could find and that should be fine Okay, so, um, just start, like, rubbing it on your face, um, randomly. Just, yeah. Okay, now we're gonna have some real cheeky party. So you're just gonna use this brown color, um, I think it's called, like, shit brown or something. Um, and then you're gonna start outlining the, uh, like, cheekbones, just to really make it pop. Like, um, yeah, and just start to do that for like another like two hours or so. Alright. Wrong. Wrong. Yeah, so just continue doing that. Um, should be good. Uh, yeah, just start doing it on top of the head again. Like, I don't know if you've ever seen like that scary movie where it's like head on, apply directly to the forehead. So just basically apply directly to the forehead. Okay, now you're just gonna start doing the same thing, but this is gonna be for the jawline, just in case you ladies want those stellar jaw lines. All right, so just, yeah, line up to your jawline. Unless you want it really chiseled, then um, go get a hammer, and then uh, maybe like a screwdriver, and just chisel it in yourself. Yeah, so continue to just like, okay, now you're gonna use 10 plush something, and um, just get like another brown ass color and rub it on your face. You can use your finger too. Okay, so yeah, just start throwing it on your face, honestly, it doesn't matter at this point. Just throw it on your tits for like this. Um, now you're gonna start using this another pink thing. It's gonna be smaller though. Uh, just to let you know, it's gonna be pretty small. You start rubbing that shit on too. Okay, and also like in the middle of all this, if you need to take a bathroom break, just do it, okay? Because this is gonna take a while. Um, go hit the old shatter, do what you're gonna do. Now, if you don't have that shine, you're a bitch, so you need that shine. 
terms of blowing things that's going on there. So make sure you got that shine. Um, if you don't, just put it in the foot. Um, and, uh, okay, so just keep doing this. Just give them another six hours to be fine. And they're going to outline your lips um, with like a Sharpie marker. Um, I prefer to use the red color just because it really comes out the pink on my lips. Um, it's not like it. And you can color them in too if you want to. Um, it usually lasts all day. Unless you drink a lot of water, then it'll kind of like break through all the permanent ink. <clears throat> so yeah, now you're going to use this other stuff and it's going to just really make your lips like shine. And this is the, this is the staple. This is the cherry on top. Um, Highly recommend it. Um, you can get it from any of your uh, local TGI Fridays or Red Robin. Uh, they should sell them. They're on, uh, I think it's the appetizer menu. Just go ahead and ask for it. Should be fine. Now you're going to start outlining your eyelids. And this is going to hurt like a motherfucker. Okay, I swear. It's going to hurt like a bitch. Um, may as well get a tattoo on your eye. Um, so yeah, the new ones are doing some shit underneath your eye. Um, you can go outside, pick up some dirt on the on the brush, and just go ahead and start rubbing that on. And it should give a nice, like, almost like a shadowy look. But not like the shadowy look when you, like, haven't slept for six days. And you get those big-ass dark circles under your eyes. Um, yeah. And start, like, outlining your nose, just in case you want, like, someone to see your nose. Because, you know, noses are, like, super hot. I don't know. Okay, um... So just continue with like this uh, upward motion on the nose. Yeah. Yeah, get the circle around the nose. Just like that. Yeah, you can use your finger. Just start going downwards now on the nose. Oh, yeah, that was quick. Um, didn't really get to see that one. Uh, just start spraying some shit on your face, honestly. <laughs> Yeah, that's the finished look right here. Um, uh, yeah, so we're back in a, again with another Beauty by Mina. Uh, if you guys are like ready to like go out and get fucked up, definitely use this look. Uh, okay, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, and comment. All right, peace. <laughs>